Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another week in the life of a pre nursing student. So if you're new, hi, my name is Samia. I upload college related video, specifically nursing because I'm in the nursing program. Well, not program, but I'm a pre nursing student. And also I upload a pharmacy technician day in the life or week in the life because I work in the pharmacy as a pharmacy technician. So if that's something you're interested in, then make sure to stick around and check out more of my videos and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. So yeah, come. <laughs> but anyways today is monday and uh today i'm meeting up with my sister and we're going to ikea but before that i'm gonna be stopping by school to get something done and then yeah so i'll bring you guys with me so without further ado let's not wait and let's get into that video cheers where are Look, I really like this. Oh, I don't want those. Those are ugly. It's been there though. They didn't change it up. Alright you guys, so it's about 10.30. I just came home, I'll say maybe like 20 minutes ago. My sister and I weren't planning on eating out, but we ended up eating at the Ikea place because my sister was hungry and she was feeling nauseous, so I was like, you know what, it's okay, let's go and eat something. The food wasn't good, you guys, but my sister just needed something to eat. So my plan was not to go to Foot Locker today, but my sister insists, she's like, you need some new shoes, so let's go get you some shoes. So we ended up going to well first of all we went and got starbucks and then we went to my school my sister and i go to the same school and then from there we were waiting for the bus and then while we're waiting my sister is like you know food locker is literally right nearby you want to just go at first i hesitated but then we ended up going there and you guys i did some damage to my bank because i brought shoes these are beige trucks and i'm in size six junior cute and then I, I got these super excited to use this one and then i also got another pair of crap so these are the ones with the bar inside i thought this would be perfect for winter time so i got these i could just slide it on when i go to work or like even sometime to school or maybe wear it around the house and this one is a different size you guys this is um woman size eight and that one is junior size six super excited this is my second cro time buying crocs so first time i brought it when i was doing my cna i had to buy a white crocs but i wore that for i think good six months and then after that i moved in with my in-laws and i don't know where it is honestly i still have it i just don't know where it is and even if i find it it's gonna be dirty because it's not clean and it hasn't been touched for over three four years now so and then next i got these adidas shoes you guys as soon as i saw this i was like i need to get myself one of these it's so sad this one is like exact same style comes in a a green color which they did not have my size but luckily the person who helped us was able to order it and it should come in by next week there's a plane going on literally freaking every two minutes like come on seriously you guys i usually buy black shoes okay so sometime like People think I wear the same shoes all the time but really I just have like black shoes so I'm happy that I'm adding colors to my collection I have white but that white Adidas I don't feel comfortable walking with it and my husband bought it for me but I probably 
wear it for like maybe five times but it really hurts my toes but then my husband is like you have to break it in in order for you to feel more comfortable walking in it i'm like yeah but it hurts my toe so i am so excited you guys it's lightweight which is perfect because i like shoes that are lightweight and the green one should be coming in sometime next week but it's gonna be exact same style but different color and the total you guys was 285 i don't spend that much money like ever since i started school you guys i've been really careful with money because i'm paying out of pocket for my school and now you guys let's do some ikea haul i got a lot of stuff my husband loves this plant so i got it for him we had it and then accidentally i dropped it and he was kind of mad and upset about it so i was like when i saw this i was like let me get this for him the next thing i got is this robe i got this in size small medium i really wish they had a white in this color i was gonna get white and this color or even black but unfortunately this one only comes in this beige color i'm super excited to use this and the next thing i got is a towel we have two towels in total like my husband and i we kind of like share it meant for like i had my own he had his own but we both share both of them so like i got this to use it just on my face and maybe on my hair but i'm not sure and then i also got this throw blanket we got another throw blanket the next thing we have is two garbage can i really didn't didn't need two because we already have one for our room but i needed one for my study room and the one that we already have in the bedroom i'll throw that away or i don't know find it find a place for somewhere else and then next we got is this jewelry box you guys since we moved from the other house to this house all of my jewelries are put away in a box in my closet so it's not like within my reach where i can reach it and then wear it or whatever so i thought this would be perfect for me to like keep my everyday or like simple jewelries in here so in that way whenever i'm going to school or going out or whatever it will be within my reach i will actually open it for you guys and show you guys so this is the inside and then it comes with a smaller one like this and then this is the cover and then this one goes over here the mirror goes upside down and then it goes like this and then this one goes on top right over here it's really cute you guys i really like it the next we have is two of these hanging um, i don't know the name but let me show you guys on my phone because i really don't know the name So it's like it goes in your closet or if you have like a clothing rack. So it goes there. So I have a clothing rack in my room. So I think I'm going to use the big one in my clothing rack. And the smaller one, so one is bigger and one is smaller. The main reason I got the smaller one is for my shoes. But if not, then I'm going to be using it for something else. For example, t-shirt and stuff. So I have two of these over here. And then last but not the least, we have this. I got this to wipe our bathroom mirror so yeah that's all the ikea and food locker haul i hope you guys liked it so the total i paid at ikea was 166 dollars you guys so i spent 300 for around like 500 after food uber and everything else kind of did a lot of damage to my bank account my bank account probably <laughs> empty now i don't shop often but these are the things that I really needed. Well, some of the things I really needed. Some of the things I didn't have to buy. But some of the things I really needed. So, anyways, you guys. I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for coming and hanging with us today. Gave you too much, now I'm swallowed. Breaking rules Dangerous path that I follow oh, 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 oh. Go on, just do what you do
guys so today is the next day and it's about 205 and I'm getting ready to go to work so I woke up and I tried to like edit it a little bit because last night you guys by the time we finished eating and my husband and I like to watch shows while we eat so by the time we did that it was kind of late so I didn't edit so I was editing this morning and now I'm heading to work so I just wanted to update you guys and I will see you guys when I come back from work Alright guys, so it's about 5 o'clock, I think 5, 5, 10 now. I got some gyro, so I'm gonna be eating this and you guys, it's been crazy busy today. I regret coming in. guys so it is the next day after i came home from work yesterday i felt really tired and exhausted it was crazy busy you guys i didn't even get to update you guys oh my god so what happened is that i just found out yesterday there is a nearby walgreens pharmacy walgreens they are shutting down so all of their customers are coming to our location for the prescription as well as the regular customers and basically whatever they had in their store it's all being transferred to our store like for example medication controlled substance basically everything from that store coming to our store so you guys it was so freaking busy not just only the pharmacy the whole store was so busy and uh as soon as i walked in yesterday i was just feeling 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 prescriptions like non-stop we had 100 plus to fill when i got there and then um i told my other co-worker uh, well alicia i'm like just pull all the medication for me put it in a toad and i'll just feel 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 and that's literally what we did and then we were able to get it down to zero toward the end of the night so yeah thanks god but anyways so that's about yesterday i just had my breakfast which i had um i had cream cheese and uh, peanut butter on a toast and i made myself some coffee my husband actually loved the coffee that i use and he usually doesn't add creamer i personally like adding creamers and stuff because i cannot drink black coffee tastes good it's really good so i just have laid out my study stuff so i'm gonna be studying i'll be studying the t's exam and then after that i'm gonna go over the math class as well because i struggle with math a lot and i need to like really focus on so i'm gonna be doing math homework after i study a little bit for the t's exam so you guys i have not been studying for the t's exam for last two weeks i mentioned to you guys on previous video that i haven't been feeling really motivated and also i'm pushing 
finishing my TS exam until um, for the next semester. So, uh, but I still want to like study every day a little bit. So in that way, I'm not feeling overwhelmed at the, toward the end because that's how I was feeling. And I was like, there is no way I'm, I feel ready to take the TS exam. And so this is actually my first time trying to study for the TS exam in like over two weeks. And um, if you guys watched my previous videos, then you guys would know that I left studying this part so I'm gonna be start studying from here so yeah anyways I'm gonna study for a little bit and then I will see you guys later <laughs> morning you guys happy thursday so right now it's about 10 o'clock and i have a laser hair removal appointment today at 11 30 so i just showered and um, the lady said to shave even though i shaved like literally two days ago but i shaved again so i'm doing my underarms and my upper lip i've been wanting to get this laser hair removal treatment for the longest time you guys but i just never bothered to make make the appointment so finally i'm going in today to get my upper lips done because you guys the hair growing thicker and uh, darker which i do not like so i use one of this it comes in like three package and i usually use this to do my upper lips so i just go downward i don't know why but all of a sudden i've been seeing the hair growing thicker because i've been doing this for a while now like probably five six seven years now and uh, all of a sudden it just started growing thicker Alright guys, so I'm all ready and set to go. So this is a new place and I have never done a laser hair removal before. But this place my friend recommended me to go. So we'll see how it goes and I'll update you guys and let you guys know how it went and I'll bring you guys with me. So yeah, without further ado, let's get moving because it's... 10:35, and i was supposed to leave house by 10 30 but it's okay the appointment is not until 11 30 i was just trying to get there a little earlier but it's okay i still have time so yeah anyways let's go Alright guys, so I just got off train and now I'm walking. It's about like 15 minutes walk and it's about 11.10 so I still have time to make it on time. But on my way I got some green juice because you guys, I did not have breakfast and I was so hungry. It tastes really good. This neighborhood is really nice you guys but I don't often come here. It's Kings Highway and Ocean Parkway but it's really nice weather actually and all the trees look so freaking gorgeous
All right, guys, the sun is shining, but I am done. She did my lips. My lips are burning right now, and she said that I have to wear sunscreen every day so I don't get any discoloration around my upper lips, I guess. And she did my underarm. guys it's a couple hours later so right now it's Sima go back to sleep so it's a couple hours later it's four o'clock right now and after I came home I came home a while ago my husband already got like burger from uh, McDonald's so I just had that and then you guys I was watching the movie Good Nurse I started watching it the other day but I didn't finish it so I ended up finishing it today because i was feeling kind of tired after other walk but anyways so little update so like i feel tightness on on my upper lips and she tried to do an oil or right over here as well but she didn't get much and she did my underarms but she was saying that like be patient after a couple of treatment you should see results so this is my first treatment i am going back for my second treatment on december 1st so that's gonna be my second treatment and the third treatment i think it will be maybe end of december or maybe beginning of january i don't know and i paid 50 dollars for the underarm which is three treatment upper lips three treatment for fifty dollars so today was my first treatment and then i still have two more treatment left and then i'll see how i feel so my main concern is my upper lips honestly i don't really care about my underarm if it works perfect like you know i don't have to be shaving and stuff if i see results then i'll definitely look for my bikini and uh, maybe my legs too so i don't know anyways my bed is messy and somebody lives in our house for free rent free and gives attitude and scratch me as well <laughs> every time we get off bed he comes in and he sleeps for the whole day oh another thing you guys he's not like the other cat where you can like hold him whenever you want to hold him no he's really moody he only wants you to pet him when he wants other than that he gets mad and he scratches you see this is what i mean yeah look at him always cleaning himself Look at him you guys as soon as I made the bed <laughs> He jumped right in. He knows I'm talking about him. Yep Can you guys see him looking at you guys? He's looking straight at the camera Over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air The pain I felt is painful All is said and done Good morning you guys happy sunday so today is sunday the november 13th and i just got ready and now i'm gonna be heading to work i work today from 10 to 6 so yeah i will see you guys tomorrow or maybe after i come home if i'm not too tired and exhausted hi guys it is about and I just came home. It was so busy, you guys, and we had extra help. Usually we have like two technicians, but today we had three technicians. One person came from a different store to help us out because I think I mentioned to you guys about a store getting closed down, shut down. So all of those patients, the prescriptions, everything, they're coming to us. I will say at least... 300 prescription we filled today but it felt like more not gonna lie but yeah you guys i forgot that i had a quiz today well i knew that i had quiz for my child psychology but i totally forgot that i have a quiz for my nutrition class as well so on my lunch break my classmates were texting the group chat they're like do we have a quiz i'm like i don't think so and then i checked the syllabus and it says that we have a quiz that's dubai tonight so 
yeah I'm gonna be taking those two quizzes I have to do another assignment for my child psychology which is due by tomorrow night so I will see how I feel because I'm kind of tired and exhausted if not I'll just do it tomorrow mm -hmm. 